Hey fire signs and welcome to my channel. It's Indigo here doing your weekly love reading. This is for Leo, Aries, Sagittarius, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus for the week of October 16th through the 23rd. So we will get started here right away. First line will be you guys. Second line will be uh, the person you're dealing with. Um, and the third line will be your outcome of the week. So let's get started. Beautiful ones of love and light. Bring me all messages for our fireside of how their lover feels about them. Okay. Cut the cards here. All right. Fire science. You got to stay optimistic about your love life. True love and chemistry. How your partner feels about you. This could be the one. Reconciliation. And deception. The outcome of the week is free yourself. Give your relationship a chance. And heart-to-heart -heart conversations. All right. Um, so right away, I can see that you guys are dealing with somebody who, um, who is dealing with somebody else as well. I'm going to, I'll tip you on down here. Let me straighten my cards out here. Okay. So hopefully you guys can see all those. All right, let's see here. So, um, fire science. Um, spirit is really wanting you to not give up hope, to stay optimistic, um, especially if you are dealing with an earth sign male um, or female, because this is a general reading. But this person is your wish come true. Um, so make sure you're staying optimistic about um, them returning. Um, as we do see reconciliation in the center for them as well. So, um, wow. With true love, you guys have the fool and the empress. So, um, this relationship is going to, it is going to go into the next stage. It is going to get that new beginning, that, um, that fresh energy, that's going to allow the two of you to create many things together, many positive, um, beautiful things that is based out of this romance of a lifetime. Really, really great cards. Fire signs. Wow. Yeah. You just have to remain, um, remain faithful, remain, um, it's, it's requiring you to keep the faith, stay optimistic. Um, don't give up on your, uh, wish because your wishes are about to come true with this earth sign that is coming in towards you. Uh, this romance of a lifetime is going to create many, many new beginnings and many beautiful things between the two of you. Some of you even could, um, be getting pregnant, um, within the next three months. <clears throat> um, there has always been a connection between the two of you. There's always been chemistry from the minute you guys. <coughs> Excuse me. <laughs> I just sneeze. From the moment you two laid eyes on each other, that first um, glance at each other, you, you knew it was different. You knew it was special. Um, the magnetic connection between the two of you is just something you've never shared with anybody else. Oops, I thought I had a flipper in there. And so, you know, this is, this is different. So, um, don't start doubting it now because you guys are so close. Maybe I did it. See one. Oh, yeah, there it is. Wow. Strength. Look at all this major arcana. Amazing. Um, stay strong. Keep fighting for this relationship, uh, because it is going to come together. Oh, I think, oh. It is going to come together very, very soon. 
how your partner is feeling about you. Uh, they already know that you are the person that they want to spend forever with. They have taken the time to think this through, to, uh, to figure out all their options and to um, really decide how to bring this relationship into a fruition. They've already healed. They've already done the work and they are now in a time of movement. They are moving towards you. Why is reconciliation here for a fire science person? Oops. Okay. A lot of, these are a lot, there are a lot of cards, but, um, they are returning from your life as soon as they um, put to rest this relationship that they're trying to get out of. Um, you're waiting to hear from them. You're waiting to hear that it's a go. Let's let's start this over. You seem very confused by this person's actions at times, but they have been illuminated. They have been enlightened. They have recognized the connection and they are moving forward towards you. They are making decisions. They are making choices. They are making um, plans of movement. Um, they have to be careful of deception in their energy. There's somebody that they're dealing with, most likely somebody that they're married to. Um, the hair front is, uh, represents a Taurus energy. It does not have to be Taurus, but um, this is most definitely somebody that they're in a marriage with. Um, with the Hierophant card, they have to be cautious um, because there is things going on behind your person's back with their spouse. Um, yeah, they just can't stay in this relationship any longer. There's no love here. Um, they want a relationship that is based on love. Um, they may love their person, but are not in love with their person. They are, however, in love with you. And that is why they are moving towards you. Um, the outcome of the week is free yourself. Make sure your energy is cleared and, um, and you are taking back control of your life. This could be, um, caused by a tower moment. Some of you could be dealing with addictions and, um, it's time to break free of those to detox your body. Um, for those of you not dealing with addictions, it's time to free or they, the person that you are dealing with, it's time for them to free themselves of this relationship that's holding the two of you um, from moving forward. And they will do that. Um, wow. They will do that uh, by delivering their partner this news that they are moving forward. And it is, oops, and they are moving forward. It is going to cause a tower moment in this person's life between them and their committed relationship they're currently um, getting away from. This relationship will gain momentum into uh, the future now. It is going to move very fast after they deliver this tower moment to their person they're currently dealing with. Wow, way too many cards. Why just give your relationship a chance? So um, you guys will begin to work on your relationship. You guys will be moving into a more committed, um, wow, the lovers, into a more committed relationship with this person you're waiting on. They are choosing you, you are choosing them, and it's time now to work on your relationship together. Um, you guys will be having a lot of um, dis discussions about your future. Um, you guys will be openly discussing your feelings with each other. Um, yeah. And like I said, there are going to be major choices made, made major decisions moving forward, leaving um, the coldness in the past and really both of you just standing in your power together. Um, whoa. Yeah, Queen of Wands, there you guys are, fire signs, beautiful. Look at this amazing energy um, that is coming between the two of you when you guys come together. And the Six of Swords. To end the week, you guys will be moving together. You will be uh, you will be bridging the gap between the two of you that has been keeping you separated. And you are now moving forward um, and moving together. A lot of you are going to be moving in together. Um, yeah, amazing. 
Yeah, this and this is your this is a soulmate. Um, the seven of cups to me is a, a soulmate energy. Um, when it comes out in a in a love reading, one and seven. This is your soulmate that is coming back to reconcile with you guys. So um, keep the hope. Remain faithful to your journey because your person is coming back to you this week. Um, after the tower moment is brought out in their current relationships. So I hope you guys have an amazing week and I will see you next time. God bless.